as in a victory trophy and all this took place in the reign of Mahapadvananda and claimed to the Ekarat. Apne ko kya kehne lage? I am the strongest of all, Ekarat. And the sole sovereign who destroyed all other ruling princes. So this is Mahapadvananda. The Nandas were the first non Kshatriya rulers. The last Nanda rulers was defeated by Chandragupta Maurya who was founded by Mauryan Empire. And then Magadha Empire jo increase kar gaya, ye chota nahi kiya, jaha ye tha, Urisa ko le liya and all this reason has been also taken. Iska malab ki, he has increasing his empire, yes or not? What is the causes of the rise of Magadha? So, humne aap se pehle bhi discuss kiya tha, what is the causes? Geographical equation, both with Rajgir and Patliputra situated the strategic location. Yes. Abundance of natural resources such as iron enabled Magand rules to equip with the effective weapons. Iron, the Jharkhand region and all. And the allele soil of the Gangetic plains make it sufficient rainfall with their conducive agriculture produces, agricultural economy. And the rise of town and use of metallic money boosted the trade and commerce and the princess could levy tolls and accumulated wealth to pay and maintain their army. If there is money, then the army will maintain the army. The army keeps on growing. And if the army has a lot of wealth, it means that the wealth is also a lot of wealth. They are having a good amount of wealth. Use of elephants on a large scale in the wars with its proximity to ancient Kalinga, unorthodox character of Magadhan society. Understood? This is about why do the Magadha has been rising. Now let us see the socio-economic condition of what is in it during this. Besides socio-economic condition during Mahajanpadas, besides the establishment of big empires, another important feature of the age was what? Increased prosperity and growth of towns. As I have said to you earlier that uh, first urbanization is IVC and second urbanization started with 16 Mahajanpada, Magadha. Understood? And then I said that the primary reason for increased prosperity of India was its growth of foreign trade within the countries of Northwest, Western countries and several countries of Asia. Aspas Burma Ogre Pongate Yade, up this side is Burma, this side I, we have taken toward the Northwest and then we have also started moving toward the what? After the Greek, we started moving towards the Northwest also and then we have moved towards, I said, also towards Arabian Sea and Southeast. So we are able to reach to the and when we trade a lot of trade, there will be more demand of, to produce the goods. And if there will be more demand, then we will have to what is produce more and more, more industrialization and more urbanization started coming into existence. And then the India become the what? Source of wealth. And therefore, people what do they They started attacking. And then another route started from what I said that, or some route they came, there were several trade routes. You have probably idea how to go and how to go. So just you have to see how to go west and then how we will come to Arabian Sea and how we will go to the east side. There were several trade routes and routes in different parts of India. One trade route was Kosambi. Did you see that? Magad se Kosambi. Kosambi that is Ilhaba. Then we will move to Punjab through the Gandhi Plain to Punjab. And then we come to Taksila and Taksila se cross kiya humne Khaibar Pass and then enter into Iran. And then I thought that we will not go to Iran, we will go to Central Asia, Bacteria and all, we will go up. And then European countries and several countries of Asia we started moving from which reason? Trade route of? Yes, which trade route? Magad se Koshambi, Koshambi to Punjab, Punjab to what I said that? Taksila and Taksila say we have entered to the Khyber Pass and then coming out in the Iran and then moving towards the West Europe and then Central Asia and other countries started moving. And thereafter we have been able to see another route that is from the Rajgir to Koshambi. Of Koshambi and Koshambi say we move to Ujjain and Ujjain se hum log port ke tarap pahunch ke Bharuch Lothal ke paas this is in a Bharuch I said that jahaan pe Narmada river is debauching making its estuary that is in a Bharuch and from where the trade was carried on the western countries through the sea route so which sea route we have seen yes tell me which route we come to Rajgi, Rajgi to Kosambi, Kosambi to we reach to what? Uh, Avanti, Ujjain and then we move to what? Bharuch. 
then another one important route pass through the entire gangetic plane and reach the boundary of Burma and then one and another it is in a southeast. So, you know, Magad Empire grow karega. Understood it? So, he developed, you know, better trade route. And then we will see that this increased prosperity of the Indian affected their social structure as well. And town becomes not only the centers of trade, but centers of trade. More demand to produce goods and more demands to produce goods. That is in a what? Industrialization. And then industries as well. And various goods were produced on a large scale to fit the foreign trade. And that could be possible only the towns or vice versa. You have to industries so you have the town so then then we can be able to so where is the second urbanization when the 16 Mahajanpada started coming second urbanization started by the time Indian rules have has started minting good points of different metals yes or not there is a high need of what currency yes this is the demand for increasing the economy it helped in the development of trade and growth of industries because coins proved to be the good medium to exchange and thus facilitated transactions and the growth of trade and industry formed rich trading and industrial communities which concentrated themselves towards town. Sorry, rich industrial, sorry, people can't like it. They started concentrating towards. And we find the existence of different guilds formed by the traders. group And then that is an order. This is the this traders, this group of traders, this trade of group of traders. Can you think of what kind of established or further isi ka fayda kisko hua? Moryas. And the guilds formed by the traders and industrialization during this period and it created in a various organized and consciously awakened what groups in the towns which finally resulted in the formation of several sub caste of the groups one again to koi ban gaya baniya koi ban gaya kuch kavi kuch so several sub caste also the sub caste came into existence due to what a system within the traders understood Yes or not? The sub caste has come into existence. How? We have so many castes, na? So that is in a not caste, which is in a sub caste has been come into existence due to what? Ab ab kalam aur dawat bana rahe ho, to ab log kuch aur ho jaoge. Somebody is doing this, 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 then, then that they will be able to get what? So, sabhi logon ka ek apna apna ek naya sub caste has been created, and then we can be able to see in the post Vedic times, society was clearly divided into. In the Vedic age, last of Vedic age, latter Vedic age, when it is a ending, but it was not in a clear cut division. But in the post Vedic time, there is a clear cut division slowly came into existence. Aapko dikh raha kyun aagya? Yes. Ab ye aapka kaam hai, tum aao mere paas kaam karo and you do that, you do that. Therefore, what is it? Clear cut division of Varnas. So, which is facing the clear cut division and which is having the what? Start of division. Later Vedic, start of division in vague form, clear cut division of four varnas in which post Vedic. These are Brahma, Kshatriya, Vesya and Sudra. Each varna was assigned well defined functions though it was emphasized that the varna was based on birth and higher varnas were given some privileges. Or the varna system Not on the basis of occupation and all but you started getting, getting on the basis of Chahi aap kuch bhi ban jau, you are what is na? Birth. And then naturally the Varna divided society seems to have generated tensions. Ab kaisa ho raha? Tension is coming. The Chhatriyas who acted as a ruler reacted against the domination of? Pahle lag nahi raha tha, unko feeling nahi ho raha tha ki Achcha, mein bhi thik hoon, Chhatriya ke bagar mein nahi raha sakta hoon. Tension tab hota hai na ki I can exist without you also. So, log bolte hai, side ho jau. Cut le. The Chhatriya who acted as the rulers reacted against the domination of priestly class and called Brahmanas who claimed various privileges. Brahmanas aaz bhi nahi, puri history mein bolte rahe do. Free grants, land, here and there. And then <laughs> it was one of the cause of the origin of new religions and that which religion? Tension in the society? Yes. Yes. Tension. Ki kaun sabse jada growth hua? Traders grow hua na? Sabse jada who has been grown? Traders. And who were the traders? Vaisya. 
yes and then Vardhaman Mahavira who founded Jainism jo ki Brahmanas ke against started going and then I said that Gautam Buddha who founded Buddhism belonged to Chatriya clan and then both disputed the authority of Brahmanas but the cause of the rise of the new religion lay in the introduction of what is a new agriculture economy in the north east India wo grow karne lag gaya tha na yes sir not that some reason agriculture economy and then west side started becoming more powerful and the further cited the rise of large number of cities in the north east India and then earliest points belong to the what 5th century BC and they called that punch mark coins and the use of coins naturally fascinated trade and commerce which added to the importance of the west side and then trade of money lending was established in the Vedic age. The practice of providing loans on the interest was also legal, but the trade was generally, uh, what is it, looed upon by the Brahmanas and the Vesya was not happy with this. Therefore, Vesya who practiced this trade wanted to raise their social position. Brahmanas unko de nahi rete position that there is a, what is it, a religious and social tension it is considered as a social. Brahmanas ko, Vesya ko kya kya rata mesa? And uh, so Vesya standard support to both Mahavira and Gautam Buddha. And the Vedic aptness of killing cattle in the ritual was also supposed to be found to be inimical to the emerging agriculture economy. Besides that, our, I mean, or bhi kya chahiye? Economy mein hamara growth ho raha hai. So we do not also need those animals in the agriculture. Therefore, we should not kill. 